And the idea behind the Book of Hours was to think about or reflect on how we measure time. Um, there are many tools that we use every day to measure time. It can be a watch, it can be a series of photographs that you have on your phone, it could be a calendar. In this case, it's a collection of objects that bring back personal memories. So we chose 24 objects that are photographed throughout 24 hours of the day. After being photographed, one of the moments were selected so we could really bring out these aesthetic qualities of the object. The photographs were commissioned to my sister, Anna Gomez Leon, and then we also added 24 texts done by my other sister, Maria Gomez Leon. Uh, so it's a collaboration between my personal collection of objects, the lens of a photographer, of, a, of someone who would look at them through a different eye, and then how that would trigger or inspire some of the stories that my sister Maria, who is a poet, would, would make. The title of the book is related to the idea of the Book of Hours of the Middle Ages in Europe, which were prayer books, and you would have a prayer for each one of the hours. So it's almost like using these uh, objects as objects of contemplation, but also for meditation, and just for like a way to remember you know, the passing of time and the passing of the day. And to me, of course, they hold a different kind of uh, meaning or symbolism but the intention is to remind ourselves that these little things that we start collecting have a specific uh, reason. Uh, like you might hold something that is related to a person, but it also tells a story. So to me, these objects uh, have become a way of understanding the world, of uh, understanding relationships, but also have uh, become sources of inspiration for my work. We work with Maricris Herrera. Um, she is the director of Estudio Herrera, an editorial and graphic design studio in Mexico City. We decided to do something that was very simple, so it becomes a provocation for thought rather than imposing something. We were thinking of a more elongated format, something that would be a little bit different you know, than the typical size of the book, but also the, the cover of the book has this um, slight shine to it, so it's very reflecting of the light and it's also embossed with some of the uh, shapes of some of the objects that are in the book so there's a suggestion of what is happening inside almost like an imprint uh, like um, a footprint on a sand but it's very subtle um, and I think it sparks curiosity no it's not telling you much you have to look through the pages and then find for yourself Translating the, the book or presenting it in this exhibition, we thought about 12 tables that would represent the 12 hours of the day. And the idea was to show uh, that subtle change between moments and the gap between them. And each one of the objects that are presented in the table was photographed around uh, the time that is presented in, it, in the table.